Nearly 200 earthquakes were recorded in Yellowstone National Park in just the past. Yellowstone awakens. 200 earthquakes, fleeing wildlife, and a geyser eruption spark supervolcano fears. In the heart of America's oldest national park, Yellowstone has always been a place of wonder and of quiet, lurking power. But in recent weeks, that power has shown signs of stirring. According to official records from the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, and Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, YVO, a swarm of over 200 small earthquakes has been detected rumbling. Beneath the park's surface, in just a few days, these shallow tremors are centered near the massive Yellowstone caldera one of the largest active volcanic systems in the world. While most quakes are too small to be felt by humans, their increasing frequency and clustering patterns have drawn the attention of both scientists and concerned citizens alike. Then came a second surprise unusual wildlife behavior. Herds of bison, elk, and even wolves were spotted migrating en masse from traditional grazing zones. Seemingly moving away from the geothermal hotspots and caldera rim. Viral videos showed bison galloping along park roads while birds flew erratic overhead. Tourists and local guides began to wonder aloud, are the animals sensing something we can't? As tensions rose, a hydrothermal eruption occurred at Labial Geyser. A lesser known but active thermal vent located near Yellowstone Lake. Though the eruption was small and short-lived, it sent boiling water and steam several meters into the air, creating a minor panic among visitors nearby. With a trifecta of geological tremors, fleeing animals and erupting geysers, social media exploded with speculation. Is Yellowstone about to blow? Some drew parallels to the past, citing how earthquake swarms preceded the 1980 Mount St. Helens eruption. While others warned that animal migrations have historically signaled natural disasters from tsunamis to earthquakes, But before panic sets in, what does the science actually say? Behind the shaking, what the experts say. According to us, GS Yellowstone experiences 1,000 to 3,000 earthquakes per year, most of them grouped into what scientists call earthquake swarms. These swarms are not necessarily signs of magma movement. Instead, they are often caused by slipping faults. Fluid migration underground or minor pressure adjustments in the crust. The recent swarm of 200 plus quakes, while notable, falls well within this normal range of activity. The largest quake in the swarm registered around M2.8, 
far below any threshold that would suggest magma is rapidly rising. Meanwhile, the labial geyser eruption is also not out of the ordinary. Yellowstone contains over 10,000 hydrothermal features, including 500 geysers, many of which erupt sporadically as underground water is superheated and released through steam pressure. The world's tallest active geyser, Steamboat, erupted dozens of times in recent years, including during major swarm events, yet Yellowstone remains calm. As for the animals, wildlife experts from the National Park Service and local ecologists suggest that these movements are part of seasonal behavior, influenced by temperature shifts predator patterns, and even recent wildfires in nearby forests. They caution that interpreting animal behavior as a prediction of volcanic activity is not scientifically reliable. What would a real warning look like? If Yellowstone's supervolcano were truly awakening, scientists say we'd likely see several clear warning signs, including strong, deep earthquakes above magnitude 4.0 increasing in frequency, rapid and widespread ground uplift, measurable by GPS and satellite A sudden change in gas emissions, especially sulfur dioxide and carbon dioxide levels. Temperature increases across large thermal areas and geysers, becoming hyperactive or permanently altering their cycles. None of these indicators are currently present. The ground deformation in the Yellowstone caldera has been minimal or stable. And gas emissions remain well within historical norms. The current volcano alert level for Yellowstone is still green normal. The lowest on the USGS scale, the hidden system below Yellowstone Beneath Yellowstone lies a complex dual magma chamber system stretching dozens of kilometers across.